Yo, live at Weedle West. It's in the Cup podcast, and I'm here with my man Alpha Wave. Alpha yo, Wave. Yo, yo, what's poppin'? What's going on, man? How, how you feeling, man? Tell the people how you feeling. Shit, I'm feeling good. I'm always fucking feeling lit. There's nothing new. I do this shit every day, man. Hey, I'm in the fucking moment. I'm living it out, man. 24, Word. doing what I gotta do. Yeah. Shout out to Young Baca Productions, putting on yeah. this show. Great vibes, great coach all around. How, how, how would you describe uh, the process of how you got to your name, man? Pretty much describing to my name, man. It started from, like, you know, a heartbreak and shit like that. Pissed off, mad. I started making beats in the garage, and next thing you know, I'm here performing my songs live. I was not, never expecting to do any of this anytime fucking soon. But, hey, it all depends who you fucking know. You live out your fucking dream. You get fucked up. Make your beats. Make your lyrics. Make your stuff. Get inspired by your favorite artist. And, bro, it escalates by itself. I'm dead ass serious, bro. Like, now I'm having opportunities for promoters to fucking perform my own music live. And, you know, people may not like it, but, hey, I still have a shot. I have an opportunity. That's, That's all a- that matters. Never burn your bridges. Live all your life. Do what you like. love to do, man. Fucking nine to five, but we're but we're slaving to that. But we gotta do what we gotta do to eat, right? Bro, you said it all. That's exactly what it is, man. We really gotta just gotta chase these opportunities, man. Oh. And isn't it a great time to be in hip hop right now? We just said there's so much opportunity now. Now that hip hop is pop music, hip hop is global. You know, hip hop is a is a world renowned genre now. Everybody's fucking with it. There's a lot of different things like you do. You say you started off producing. I started off producing, making beats and stuff. You know, I messed with. I messed with FL Studio for a minute and I was like, I'm gonna make a beat, laid it out. It sounded corny as fuck, you know, it sounded cringy, but hey, man, I started making other beats and it was fun. Can and we cuss on this podcast? You do whatever the fuck you want, Okay, bro. cool, I'm not sure. I see you <laughs> editing you. on your computer, man. Like, <laughs> no, 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 I was just making sure we're straight. Now, nah, okay. bro, so, 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 when, how long did you, were you producing until you started making, like, rapping on it? A year. A Literally year. a year from like right now. I started from using other YouTube producers' beats. Six songs in total of other producers' beats. I was like, when the seventh song comes, it's my beat, my own production. Cut out the middleman. I'm the middleman. I'm the CEO. Oh, I'm yeah. everything. There's no drama between that. Do it yourself. It's hard work. You got to put in the time, but it's well worth it because you don't got to answer to no one except yourself or whoever's around you, man. So you've been doing this whole thing for a total of how long? A year, two years? Probably for like a year. Year, uh, man. A year, you yeah. seem to got the whole mentality and the whole game unlocked, though. Yeah, you, yeah, you know what? From you know what? It's just all about grinding and kind of doing your own research at that point, man. Word, I feel you. You I do your it. own research because no, you know what? You can kind of get fucked over for your money. You could be spending like 200 bucks to perform at a venue that's not yeah. cracking with no clout, no attention, no nothing. You know, you just gotta market yourself right and smart. And hey, man, the the, the payouts there with no money involved, all about exposure. You're a real businessman, huh? I do have my own brand, yes. Yeah, so oh, I have that. I have that mentality in What's here. What's the brand, man? Give it a shout out. It's a radical appeal. A radical appeal. It's a skating, uh, self ambition. If you basically have your own ambition to make your career, that's the rad life. That's my motto. You're living and you're creating your own rad life. Do it. Stop working for the man all your life and just do what makes you happy. Because when you're old, what are you gonna do? Oh fuck! I fucked up and sat down, and that's all I did was listen to somebody. There you go. Live all your life, bro. That's all I gotta say, man. Man, that was beautiful, man. Yeah. How, how, well, before you go, man, just so the listeners can ask something to look forward to, what, how would you describe this, your, the sound of your music? All about emotion, the way how I'm feeling. We all go through self-depression, and that could totally bring you down to here, bro. It could. We all been there. We all done that. If you could find your way out of it by doing something you love, painting, music, art, you know, talking to people at your 9 to 5 to make your day better, that's all worth it. Keep yourself mentally healthy, physically healthy, you know, and then you're gonna strive until your until your time comes, man. Until your time comes, all I can say. You, you really think about a lot of. Are you a very thinkative person, very introverted? You things have like a lot of very well-rounded thoughts on a lot of things. True. Yeah. I don't know. I always think a lot. I'm the quiet type. Uh-huh. I'm always the guy spacing out with the joint in my hand or taking dabs, I spacing that. out. People are like, "Why are you so quiet?" Because I'm thinking. I'm trying to plan for my future, man. Bloody. You gotta sound. You gotta have a good first approach. If you sound like a bitch or you don't know what you're doing, no one's gonna want to work with you. You know what I'm saying? You gotta have attitude. Yeah, bro. You sound real hungry for this. I am, dude. It started from making beats. It started from getting someone to work, get on my beat and me engineer their voice. And now I'm now I'm doing my own thing, making collab tracks with other artists from the IE and LA County, man. Like Whoa. I'm hungry as fuck, and I'm just here living out my life, doing what I love, and no one can tell me nothing because. I'm not signed. I'm independent as fuck. No one's, no one's my boss except myself. 
I do have a boss at a 9 to 5, but you know, it is what it is, man. We gotta eat. You gotta, eat. You gotta do what you gotta do to support the dream, bro. Yeah, exactly, yeah. man. Hell yeah. yeah. Alright, bro. Appreciate you having me. Oh, yeah. Boys, brother. Hey, shout out to the podcast, man. I love it, man. Keep doing what you're doing, too. Appreciate because, you. hey, man, you're gonna be bigger than No Jumper in LA. You know what I'm saying? Appreciate you, bro. <laughs> Sit down soon. Oh, yeah. You guys stay up, man.